Welcome guys, this is Gibby Gibson and today I will be showing you how to create a craft bucket server. So um, I'm just going to create a new folder to start out with and call it server and I guess that'll work and um, we're going to want to come into your browser and download um, craft bucket so let's get beta build and keep this and while that downloads we're going to dot minecraft and download um, this minecraft server right here the one not this one this one right here alright and then we're gonna keep keep them both and and then when they're both done okay now we're just gonna drag them both into our server. Alright, uh, and then the Minecraft server.jar, just click on that and let it load. It'll create a new world and everything. And while well that's loading, we'll wait for that to be done and then just get out of it. Okay, it'll take a sec to get out of, but okay, we got all this for now. So now just um, create a new text document because this is it. and then we're gonna, just going to call it run.bat and and then we're not going to make it a text file so run.bat and I'll show you what to do with that later alright so I'm going to come into here actually no we're going to command prompt and search ip config okay easy enough and then we got scroll up just a tiny bit and we got our default gateway we're gonna want to put that up. Oh, we're gonna want to put this in here. So, oh. all right. So we're just gonna go type it in. I I memorized mine. So one two point one six eight point one six eight point one point one, and then enter. And then we'll open it up. That if it asks you for a password, I th um if your parents or whoever you are, like um made it so you can't do that like get into it without a um, username password but if you didn't the username should be admin and the password should be password alright so we're just gonna come into advanced when we're in here and go to port forwarding slash port triggering and we are going to um, create a new one so server um, address so just then we're gonna come into here and then see this one right here it says 102.168.1.2 so put a, one, put a 12 in there oh. or whichever one you says it'll probably be different and then we're gonna add it and we're gonna click on that and edit the service and this is for minecraft 1.5 like 1.5.1 and 1.5.2 sorry and then yeah, then we're gonna just gonna do that, and then make it. Um, let's just call it server. And then we're gonna do the default gateway. So two five five six five. And then same thing down here, two five five six five. And that's good so far. So then we're gonna click apply. And then that's all you need to do there. And then right here, um, this one back. Just click edit, and then right here we're going I'm gonna go I'm gonna put this in the description but we're gonna I'm gonna click edit um, this one and co like copy everything on here so control C to copy I'll have this in the description so just copy that and paste it and we're gonna edit and put it in here and save alright and now we're gonna run this alright so I ran into a little problem but let's see if it works now and right here it's unable access to jar file what is the jar file oh okay so we'll just rename this and control c everything and then edit and see right here we are going to open this and delete all of this and paste that into there then we're going to save it and get out and then run it okay now let's see what's wrong here Oh, I know. We gotta go into our server properties and then put in our IP. So 
point twelve for me. And then just put everything like right here. I'll show you what this is. So I'm just gonna put Gibby Gibbs for now. And we're gonna save, get out, and run it. And then it says problem. So we'll try it on this one instead, just to see if it works for now. Alright, so let's wait for it. It says done now. And we want it to run with craft bucket and not this. So we're gonna get it to run with this, but it says it's not working. But we will fix this by here. Let's see, let's see if it works on my original server. Let's get out of this, and then we'll run it. See, oh, I know what's wrong with it. Um, it says it's a uh, like copy of it because I've already have a server set up. So yeah, just do the original, do everything with yours, and see if it works. So it it works. Trust me, just not with the new folder because I already have a server set up. Alright, so yeah, that's pretty much all you gotta do. Now we'll see if our server works. We're gonna log in. And then, let's get full screen. Go to multiplayer, and my ser And you're gonna want, like, a certain server. Put this, go to ipchicken.com. This will all be in the description. And then, after you go to, um, see this, just copy it. And then come to add server, call it whatever you want, and then paste it in and click done. And then let's find it. See right here. And it says Gibby Craft because that's my server. So we'll join it. And I'm in lava. Alright, so yeah, see it works. I've been doing a thing with my friends. So yeah. We've been doing everything, so yeah, so um, just look at another video if you want to see how to put in plugins because that'll just take too long for me to show you. Alright, so yeah. This is Gibby Gibson, 3409. Comment, subscribe, like. Goodbye.